It's called Ebenezer and the Invisible World. 90% sure someone mentioned that it's on stream that the girl looks like Paula. She does look like Paula. Do you play it with light pistol? No, we play it with heavy bazooka. There were some quotes. I wasn't reading them because I was reading chat. I don't feel like this is a very long demo. I opened it just for a little bit to see if there was an options menu, and there wasn't an options menu. Surprisingly, no voice acting I ran across either. Bah, humbug. So this is a Christmas game. It very much should, should come out at Christmas. Oh damn, there's a demo? Yeah. It's a pathway to redemption for Caspar. I will weave through the people of his life. They meant most of him and knew him well. Even if you knew Casper Mouth, this was a good man. That was some time ago. How you be sure that such a person still exists? I confess I'm not well formed on the metamorphosis that transpired within him. It's imperative that we unravel how he became the man he is today. I feel like we're some missing a little bit of plot. But I guess that's a demo for you. Caspar kept a journal in the London Observatory. Secreted away from the prying eyes of his father. That journal is still there and may it help us understand how he drifted so far from how I remember him. I too was once a man that lost his way. My good friend Jacob Marley helped me see that. And his brother, the other Marley. I see that you're doing the same thing for your friend, Caspar Malthus. Very well, I'll find Caspar's journal. So this is the reformed Ebenezer. This is more of a sequel to the Christmas Carol. This is Christmas Carol 2. Thank you, Ebenezer. You must exercise the utmost caution tonight. Casper has already put his plan into motion to displace the workers of London. Workers are protesting, and soon there will be a standoff between the protesters and Amalthus' private guard. Union power. The guard has been deployed to patrol the streets, no doubt eager to showcase the metal to anyone sympathetic towards the plight of the workers. Like you, Ebenezer, you're an influential fellow that has lots of money and likes the workers now. Thank you for your warning, spirits. I shall make my way now to the London Observatory to find Casper's journal and learn the truth. Very repetitive. Okay, let's see. There we go. I got the D-pad working. Oh, th that's a hell of a jump for an old man! Man, he really got a, a bit more spry. Industrious Caspar Malthus promises a dawn of a new age for London. Old man's got hops. And backsliding. He can backslide! Careful outside, sir. There have been protests recently here in London. They become quite dangerous. Just decorate all the trees in my mansion. Not celebrating Christmas is a humbug. Fizzywig! How pleasant to see your bright face of my former employer. Hello, Ebenezer. You have made a name for yourself since you worked for my company. I'm here to provide assistance as you advance in your quest. Thank you, I am very grateful. There's never been a limit to your generosity. Also, weren't you a bear? Press th this button to accept, uh, access your map. London is a big city with many places to explore, and the map is essential to making your way through the city. Man, if you only could talk to spirits. Can you imagine the money you'd get on the poker table? I'm not letting you cheat, Ebenezer. I might be jolly, but I'm not stupid. Stave one. Go to the worker strike. All the, all the people in the foreground. Wow, that guy could jump. 
Main character has hops and backdash. Yep, there's Castlevania in this blood. I'm getting a lot of uh, Symphony of the Night feel here. Uh, well, we can't go to Bedlam Asylum. We need a jumpier Ebenezer. We need the spirit of Gemini Cricket. Or, uh, uh, Gemini. Gemini Cricket. Oh wait, though, that's Pinocchio. How could you? You haven't been reformed at all! Snowmen are a humbug. Signs are a humbug. Crates are a humbug. Tidy Tim! It... I can't injure him. It really was Tiny Tim. Huzzah, Ebenezer! It's Christmas time again! Thank you for your kindness this year. You have truly changed. And God bless your jump, everyone! It's just so very strange that there seems to be this trend of, uh... Ancient... Classical literature getting turned into, a, like, a weird video game. Pinocchio is fighting puppets with a sword and roguelike. And Ebenezer is jumping down London. And Winnie the Pooh is Cthulhu. Ebenezer, that protester just ahead is in peril and requires aid. Can you intercede on my behalf? You mean beat up the guy? Oh wow, he's beefy. Uh, solidarity! Uh, I'm gonna donate a thousand pounds to the workers. Good luck. That's how a rich person would do it. Alright, fine. We'll do it the game's way. Please don't. I surrender. You there! Unhand that man. Though he made him committed transgressions, he has surrendered himself. Police violence! You and your friends are not but surplus population. Hey, wait a second. That's my line. Accept your fate, you pitiful swine. Oh, my. Oh, that's violent. You're next, old codger. Backstep or you'll get the big bonk. Backstep or you'll get the big bonk. That, that there's damage numbers. That feels uh, sort of the, the Symphony of the Night. Metroidvania Castlevania. Thank you, kind sir. Let me help you home. No, I'll be fine. You need to find a safe haven for Warren Gastel as a merciless fellow. And you're in grave peril in his presence. Castell's not for neutral neutralizing protesters. He and the Malta's private guards are hunting anyone involved in a protest. Now you'll be on his list too. I shall heed your warning. Find safety. I wonder if they actually got people in a sound booth for the cheers, or did they just go and record a strike somewhere? Eric, why would you unable to help that man yourself, except for the obvious, of course? I had the wish to hate that man, but my curse in the afterlife is that I cannot. Oh, that again. The, the ghosts of greedy and violent people cannot help people once they've died. That old thing. You have been vi visited by the Christmas spirits and can see me and other ghosts. I can help those in need through you, and I can help you. Granting assistance on that man on my behalf, on my behalf, I should join you tonight and help you further. Symphony of the Night After Christmas. <laughs> we got ghost power. We gain spirit by hitting enemies with your cane. We've got ghost. So why button to use ghost? Yeah, well, what's all this, then? The far side of the city is old Jonathan Beslam Asylum, but I, I haven't been able to jump high enough to get there. It's a dangerous place now, in any case. 
Just stay away for your own safety. Hey, what are you doing with that? You didn't pay for that, good son! Come back here! I thought you changed! Uh, I thought I was gonna be able to parry that, but we got Violent Ghost. Wow, that's, uh... Wow. Wow! Get hit by old man? Dissolve. Ebenezer only has this power. Oh, I, I, I should change the name of the game so people aren't confusing this with Gunman's Proof. Uh, what was this called? Uh, Ebenezer, The Invisible World? And The Invisible World, yeah. There we go. And the plus live at least melee attacks destroy enemy projectiles. Really hope they tone down the tutorializing a bit in the full release. Or at least spread it out a little bit more. Don't need to apologize, Fizzywig. You were a great help. If you continue right, you'll find a save room. A save room where you can save your progress and replenish your health and Christmas spirit. I'm calling it Christmas spirit if I ever play this game further. I mean, come on. This is like a longest night game. Look for the sign with the feather pen. Every save room has a sign nearby. Also, why are you breaking everything? It's just on the wrong side of being too handholdy. Now that's a nice touch. I enjoy that. Where's the other Marley? I grew up with two Marleys in my Christmas Carol. Maybe I should try using ghost power. Okay, great. Good job. You use him, he immediately raptures. I know it's an uppercut. Wow! Yeah, yeeted. That's straight up a JoJo stand. <laughs> I summon Christmas Knights! Peck Snowmen! Ah. Uh, ah. The lamplighters are at work. It's Christmas Eve for certain. You there, Ebenezer. I noticed you stopped to notice my lamp flames. Put on quite a show with your flames. How do you know my name, ghost? I am Gaetano Lagrosso. There is so much to know about the people of London. Which that some may prefer I do not know. He also has chains, which means he was a bad boy in life. I remember you now. You were quite the town whisperer. Quite proud of your gossip. That was then, and this is now. I lit the flames to catch your attention. I need your assistance. Haruken! No, that's Shoryuken. He does a Shoryuken. Salvatore Garcia is writing a story about the accident in the Maltus factory. They say Declan Doyle is responsible. Like I'm supposed to know these names? Are they relevant? I feel with the unrest on the streets tonight, he could be hurt or injured. If he takes his normal route, I know a safer path. My request, Ebenezer, is to ensure that the street lamps can be seen along this route, so that Garcia may reach his destination unharmed. Many are covered with snow. Can you just hit them with a cane? Very well, I'll do what I can to ensure his way is lit. My memory of A Christmas Carol is mostly Muffet Muppets, but my memory of the voice of Ebenezer is more like Jim Carrey's. We need a copyrighted name for it, so, that, so they'll say in the dialogue. There'll be something else in the subtitles. Uh, they're Jojo sits. They're not stands, they're sits. There you go. I haven't seen Phoebe today. I'm worried about her. And you are? 
Oh, I found Phoebe. Buster Bailey. But uh, that sounds familiar. Why does that sound familiar? You, I know you. You're Ebenezer Scrooge. You're that rich miserly old man that yells at children for laughing too loud. You made my friend cry. You don't have chains. You must be a good boy. Yes, young man, I regret to say this is so. London has been generous with laughter of children. I found it quite a bother at the time. How many random cutscenes? Ah! Solve all your problems with Kane. Yes. Bailey, I think you're in the wrong movie, kid. Says Lucky Star. I would like to make amends. Is your friend nearby? I would like to apologize. By the way, I died a year after I got you the turkey. I think this is the kid that got him the turkey. Phoebe's in trouble. She snuck into the building to the right, looking for food without realizing it was occupied by Malthus guards. Now she's trapped and scared. Can you help us, sir? This nice lady here, Marianne, has been taking care of Phoebe and could take her to safety. We could find a way for Phoebe to exit the building. Of course I would help. I would find Phoebe and help her to safety. Jeez, we already have like a billion side quests. I think he said it's off to the right. So, what's your crime? You're carrying a lot of receipts there. Another um, loan officer, maybe? Like Scrooge? Wonder how many more lamps he needs. So I got quite a bit of turkey here. Seems like a healing item of some sort. I thought I could break that. Break everything else. Ghost! I thought it was gonna one-shot him. Ghost! Okay, how do I use left button? Oh good, it doesn't do the Castlevania thing where you have to throw it out in front of you first. Oh, I hope the Malthus guards don't hear me sneeze. Is your name Phoebe? Do you know a boy named Duster? A uh, Buster? Oh dear Buster, he was my best friend. Mother said Buster and I were to be married when we were uh, of age. Oh, it's that kind of, uh, yeah, Victorian England. Wait not, dear child. I'll help you get out. It's sad that your husband is dead. Marianne is close by and can take Phoebe to safety. Leave her. Also, you get Buster Bailey. So now I have spirit, uh, spirits I could change to. Oh, there we go. He make balloon. Symphony of the Night was a bit clunky compared to later entries. This was a thing in Castlevania? I'm not- I'm not reading these anymore. There's too much dialogue. I'll read Ebenezer. I mean, like, important people, like Buster. Thank you for finding Phoebe. She was the best friend in life. I do help in Marianne. Phoebe is safe. I would join you on your quest. So, uh, how do we s switch to, uh... How do we switch you? Or does he just make balloon everywhere? So this is part of the game, is ghosts help you out. Yes, I know, Fizzywig. I know I have a map. Seems to be just a passive thing now. Multiple ghosts, he's not a stand user, he's a persona protagonist. Oh, hey, a lot of people will be very proud that I'm finally playing a persona game. Wow, what's his crime? What's his crime? That doesn't seem fair. He didn't do anything wrong. He was just skating. Well, 
fine. Smash all the lights as I leave town. The lamp lighter will be quite mad. Quite upset indeed. I don't know what the crimes these people have committed that deserve beating with Ebenezer stick. This seems like a dungeon. That I can't really do because I need a ghost power that involves mirrors. Oh hey, drop some. That I can't pick up anymore now. What is that? I can't switch to it. Spirit kids, what? Spirit weapons? Heirlooms? I got mugwort for herbs. I'm not quite sure what that means. It didn't tutorialize me in that. X down to do an, a, a bounce kick. I guess I have to be bouncing. Sir not appearing in this demo. Well, I guess we do have a way to get to that uh, asylum now. I guess we fight like one boss and it's, it'll be like, thank you for playing the demo. I hope you enjoy our Ebenezer game. Ebenezer is supposed to be a light-hearted old chap. Why isn't he skating down the streets? It'll be quicker. Lies of P did kind, kind of did spoil us on sheer content, huh? Yeah, he got three bosses. Well, technically, the, the donkey was supposed to be a mini boss. Okay, there, there's the bounce. There, there's the bounce kick. I can't get up there. Wow! Explosives? In my Charles Dickens? Oh, I could do that anywhere. Oh, we Hollow Knight now. We Hollow Knight now. I'm taking your ham for that. Um, I could barely read it. I can't read what that says down there. It looks like it says cold boiled for me. I can't get into that room. It doesn't look like there's a way to get into that room right now. I wonder what the ghost coins are for. Someone's spamming the heart button. I see that. Ah, oh, yes, let's steal this treasure for the poor. Ah, uh, excuse me, what? I got some sand and coal. Well, Santa Claus is not pleased with our actions. Half the health bar. That's a proper damage for a grenade. Grenades in Victorian England? Quests. Lamp lighter. I, I, I'm missing a lamp somewhere. Is it back this way? Doesn't seem to be an attack cancel, but I could do this. Maybe I okay. I'm just checking to see if there's another snow covered lamp I kind of missed. Because I got that one, but it says there's a third.
I see something up there too that I can't reach. And he does he work in like the graveyard or something? Just coins and lamps because why not? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was hitting all the lamps up to here, so it's got to be the other way. Yeah, you can kind of like dash again if you hit the attack button while you're sliding. Otherwise, there's a bit of a lag. So I found the, f the world's first speedrunning strat. If you can do something with this, that makes it go fast. Just credit Armored Chocobo for finding it. I'm the only person that has played this game. I declared it now. No one else has played the Ebenezer Scrooge game. Boy, it sure is Christmas in here. I hope there's a fast travel feature. I hope that's in the cards. I hope there's a plan for that. Because boy, is this a run to get anywhere. Or maybe Ebenezer could turn into a wolf and run really fast. And then he could transform into a bat. I can confirm I have not played it yet. See? I am first. Oh, we're doing the Dark Souls thing where we respawn the enemies when we save, huh? Oh, sure, you can you with a ghost. Don't tempt me. Yeet. Oh, he could do that too. We got mashed potatoes, sand, and mugwort. That sounds like a great meal. All the mashed potatoes got cold boiled. That's all, that's all it's called. Made from beef or mutton that has been boiled to perfection, this nutritious and restorative dish can help adventurers stay on their feet for long journeys. That's what it said there. I could jump down. Let's go into the sewers. Maybe it's down here. Maybe the lamp is down here somehow. No. I got your pocket sand. Um, it, he doesn't look like a ghost. And he's quite durable. He's very durable. Backslide. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't be here yet. I'll take his rosemary. Fast travel should probably be calling a horse carriage. It could be a ghost carriage, like in the book and some of the movies. Let's go to the asylum this way. There's only rats down here. And uh, occasionally a lawyer. And those guys. I don't like his poison. Ha! Aha! Outplayed! Those guys are just kind of like suffering. They don't deserve that, Ebenezer. Have you learned nothing? Well, there's things going on over here. But I can't do anything with that. Now to get out of the sewers. Oi, governor, what were you doing in the sewers? I'm wondering where I could spend all of my ghost money. Like, could I spend that on healing? Is it a way to increase my stats? 
Do I donate it to the poor? So they stop being the surplus population? They just opened up the book and it was like, okay, they mentioned surplus population, we gotta have that in the video game. Uh, it's gotta be a reformed Ebenezer Scrooge, because we don't want to rehash the same story again. Tiny Tim's there. Ebenezer Scrooge just smashes everything in sight. Even the stuff in his own manner. There's ghost coins. That was in the book, right? Okay, um... There's no balloon here. Hey, Buster! Buster, where's the balloon? Uh... I'll check my quests. Unexplored path, open path. It was more down in the well. I couldn't do anything in that room. Save room. There's something up on the roof, and out in the cemetery. I guess I had to go to the cemetery. Use the boast Buster Bailey's ghost tower to continue to London Observatory. That seems to be what I have to do next. Oh, hey, free turkey! Turkey is just falling out of lamps! Victorian England, am I right? There's this ghost coin spilling out of everything? Tiny Tim, I found a way to be rich. All you have to do is destroy as much things as possible. Can you do that for me, boy? I mean, plus for the odd style, that there's a lot about this game that's running me the wrong way, says Rain. And Rain is kind of into uh, Metroidvania is a bit more like this one. It seems to be a bit more on the RPG side of things. Like Symphony of the Night. I was expecting more like Ori or uh, La Milana, even though... Imagine how many puzzles... It would have to be to, like, compare to that. Get bustered. Get bustered. I bustered right on ya. Cause bustering makes me feel good. Just knock. Say hello, hello to Marley. Look for the London Observatory. It's gotta be up this way. Yep. There you go. Ow. Maybe... Door? I like that you, you knock them out, then they die. There's nothing here. Except for that chest that I looted. Englishmen and their weird traditions of hiding turkeys and lamps. Boing. 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 Oh, a tomato! I'm allergic! So, there's something above in the next room. That's some place I haven't been. That might be the Tower of London? There's a big bridge above us, but I haven't seen any buster balloons. Oh, wait. But these don't lead anywhere. Only to chest. Oh. Okay, then. Yeet. 
throw ghost. Oh, hey, there's an up bash, too. I have found the up bash. And there's a crouch bash. I'm trying to do the Alucard thing where you, like, attack, and then you crouch attack. Looks like there's a little bit of delay, though. Now, Super Mario platforming in my Ebenezer game. I'm wondering what all of this junk is for. Can you bash downwards in midair? Yeah, it's this. It's the boing. Finna boing. Oh hey, I could I could parry grenades with my cane. How very Scrooge of you. Short hopping doesn't seem to be in this. To replace the more standard combo string. Now Ness is really good at short hopping. Let's see, more turkey, copper. Let's put some copper in the turkey. Let's have more turkey. But have turkey everywhere. Is this game hard? He was almost Hollow Knight. On second thought, London is very silly. On second thought, London is very silly. I want to find out what the pig's now about. Why is there pig? I want to learn what the pig is. I want you to show me. Why is there? A, why is there a giant? Why is the Christmas pig here? Welcome to Jasper's Wandering Bazaar and Food Court. I am Jasper. I offer Imperium curiosities. Feast your eyes, delectable food, and rare items from all over the world. Find foods on one page and rare items on the other. So, oh, this is how you spend ghost coin. You get mashed putat, you can get some plum pudding. This this game better release in Christmas, I just gotta say. This gotta re re release around Christmas time. I won't hear it. Because it's just too Christmas to be any other time. Oh wow, there's even um, upgrade things here. 10% chance to drop health items. That seems broken. Critically strike when using attack ghost. Cane damage. Ghost attack damage based on coin. Health recovery. That also seems broken. Wolf Head Kane is renowned for familiar with the spirit world for its unique ability to connect its possessor with the spirits of man and animal. Refills Ebenezer's spirit bar meter at the fastest rate, but it probably does less damage, doesn't it? I can't afford the, 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 the super wolf cane now. So when we see the pig, if you see the pig, be very happy that you've seen the pig. Because you've got upgrades coming. Okay, what'd you do? You were naughty. I see chains. There you are, Musa. I don't know why you fly off sometimes. I don't see a rat specter or a rabbit specter. Why was the bird bad? What are you doing to the bird? That is a beautiful bird. A bird? A bird is something that eats worms and corns off the ground. This is a falcon, and his name is Musa. As in Mansa Musa, the richest man that ever lived? Yeah, he reincarnated as a hawk, and then he died. In that order. He loved hoarding gold, jewels, and other fine things. He used to treat him as a bit of a role model in that regard. I so, I so used to love having things, all things, fine things. Oh yes, you were greedy, I know what you're saying. I used to feel that way too. Looking back, I received little joy from just things. 
unfortunately, when it comes to the sole reason for your existence, it leaves little room for anything else. Oh my, materialism! The, yeah, um, I think Charles Dickens would be very proud of this video game right now. It's no wonder I ended up burdened with these chains. What'd the bird do, though? Indeed, our opportunity to help others with our things is in life. Let's do what I can. Those are out there with so few things. Perhaps I can make some of my things their things. What would that be called? Charity, giving, generosity? No, philanthropy. Philanthropy. My things have been sold at auction, taken by princes and princesses around the world. Only my once favorite dress remains here in London. Sold at a bargain to a wandering merchant. Most beautiful dress in London. I saw a poor girl wandering around, peeing into dress shops. Peeing into, peeing into dress shops at the east side of the city. She was admiring lovely dresses. But she has not a penny to purchase one. You purchased my beautiful dress from the wandering merchant. Does he take ghost coin? Ah, uh, yes, I've seen that pig. Okay, the, the girl's gonna get a dress. In not so many words, that word we're doing. Girl is getting dress. So, uh, she could pass on and the, stop torturing the poor bird. The bird didn't do anything evil. It's just a tutorial on to buy things, isn't it? So, I'm in the market for a dress. Oh, I need 500. What? I can't afford that, and I'm the richest man in London. Granted, I am rich in life now. We need to find more coins so we can buy that dress. What is it when the, the game has a lot of things, but also not a lot of things? Because that's what I'm getting at here. This is the train station. So this is fast travel, kinda? Very nice. This ghost is going to attack you, though. Feature bloat? Yeah, it feels like this is very... It's very lengthy. Loyal Falcon follows his master into the afterlife. Pig sled, yes. Pig sled is where you get the rich stuff. How dare you throw a tomato at me, madam. What have I ever done to you? Also, London is built very Cthulian. How are some of these buildings standing? Aha. Aha, I have found you being a dummy. Yeet. Oh, well, point blank with the grenade, why don't you? Point. Hey, it's a flea man. It's a slow flea man. Are you sure you don't want me to call the Ghostbusters instead of Ebenezer Scrooge? Got a lot of ghost problems. Oh no. Well, as long as the birds aren't bringing in flea men. What's all this now? Everywhere I go, I, I'm just wondering, what is this now? What other kinds of BS do they have in this game? Spooky ghost door. That'll be for the cameo DLC. Oh, okay. Harold Ramis is the ghost. The ghost of Harold Ramis helps you? Because Christmas or whatever? It's dark, but then again, that one Ghostbusters movie, they did... They did use Harold Ramis' likeness in CGI. So who's the real monster here?
I will turn you into a ghost. That's what I do. I'm Ebenezer. I make people into ghosts. Hannibal Satchel. Attracts nearby gold dropped by enemies. It's very... The font could be bigger. The font could be bigger. Because even I could barely read that. And I don't think people watching the stream would be able to pick it out either. But I got a magical item. Is it already equipped? No, I had to equip it. It didn't tutorialize me at that. Ghostbusters are on the other side of the Atlantic. Also about a hundred years into the future. There we go. Now we're magnetizing those golds. We'll get that dress in no time. I wonder how fast that spirit builds up anyway. Oh, it builds up pretty fast. Probably not the first one you're intended to get. Yeah, I've sequence broke. I've already sequence broke this game, and I learned about doing the quick slide. Yeah. I'm not looking at you, madam. Excuse me, sir, do you know the time? Yes, I suppose I do. Let me find my pocket watch. Oh, I know that model. Very good and trustworthy instrument. Of course, sometimes it does slow down in particularly cold weather. There's a few bad winters in a row. You probably should get it examined or else you're going to be running behind. Thank you. Do you have experience in engineering? I am chained to a clock. I was a watchmaker by trade in life. One of the best in the industry. Although you probably haven't heard of me, I was never one for fame. Just silly because your tutorials really should pop up on the first interaction with the system. Yeah. Not talking to people. Or leaving my house ever. Oh, so your crime is being antisocial. I see. For someone who seems to have done so little, how did you end up chained up to the mortal world? Well, that's just it, isn't it? I never did anything for anybody else. Cut myself off from the good and bad parts of humanity. Even when I was given the opportunity to bring a little happiness in the world, I chose not to participate. Your crime is being an introvert. I'm sorry I cannot help you. Perhaps you can help me with something. I had a man, John Hardwick, approached to repair a family pocket watch and engrave a heartfelt inscription on the back for his son. Performed my job well, and the man was happy with the work. I later learned that he died in an accident later that day at the Malthus factory. I chose to forget about it, even though a small part of me urged to tell the man's son about his engraved pocket watch. However, I couldn't be bothered to leave my workplace. I would like his son to have it. I think I can help you with this. I'm just accepting sidetracks all over the place. Fern in the London City Center has many friends. I didn't even fix the lamps yet. Now they want me fixing this. Is this what it would be like to be a children's book protagonist? There was coal in that snowman. Of course there'd be coal in that snowman. There was a door over there. I do like they have proper uh, uh, proper quests for extra spirits. Helps add character to what are supposed to be people. What I don't like is them throwing it in your face every few seconds. Hi, my name is Ghost Name, and I have committed crime of not being nice to people. Are just like socializing in general, apparently. Am I gonna have chains when I die because I didn't socialize with enough people? And I played video games? 
Am I gonna have to talk to Ebenezer Scrooge? Yeah, what? I see block puzzles, oh no. I'm just finding more and more quests. I haven't noticed a bit of progress. Okay. It's called story. But they got too much of it. Need more gameplay. There's the flea man again. Like, what even is it? I can't really tell. All I know is that flea man's at me. And that activates my hit it with a cane. We are all guilty. What a nice lesson this game is teaching us. Where does this lead? If something like substantial doesn't happen, like a boss, within like maybe the next 15 minutes, I think I'll call it. Because uh, I'm a. Uh, I'm actually getting a little bored. I don't even know how to complete that one quest, because I haven't seen any more uh, covered things. I don't know how to upgrade. Oh, there. Yep, the lamp on the top of town. Like, how is he going to know these lamps apart? These lamps... These lamps have no... Like, this is Lovecraftian non-Euclidean physics you've got going on here. He, he won't be able to find out... How is he gonna know the lamps apart? He's gonna go from here? Down there. The, the, below me. How? Is he going to jump? That... That legitimately made me upset. You there, halt! You look like one of our factory's lowly dredges. Are you indeed the man responsible for disrupting the activities of my men? I hit him with a cane. Must be Warren Gastel. Commander goes to stand out at once. There's no way to treat people. People? Hardly. Soon it'll be no longer incumbent upon us to attend the squalor of London in order to advance the grinding wheel of progress on behalf of the rest of society. We get it, you're Elon Musk. You seem to be a man of respectable means. I will give you one last chance to surrender and remain unharmed. Bah! Humbug! A humbug, you say? Okay, let's see what the boss fights are like in this game now. Are they gonna be like Hollow Knight? Hey, hey, he cheating. Cheating! I can eat turkey on the fly, you know. Oh, what is he doing? Whoa, that's some. That's definitely some JoJo stuff you got going on there. <laughs> it seems more like a Castlevania boss than a uh, Hollow Knight boss. Okay, maybe it's a Hollow Knighting a little bit. How does this guy have superpowers? He's just a British man. He's got like One Piece powers. He's got the commander hockey. I want to. I want to bounce on him. I want to boing on him so hard. Finna boing. Finna boing. I killed you! Aha! Mark, uh, Mark says, Quay, 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 Quay? Quay indeed. It's a pity a man of your station sympathizes with those peasants. Caspar Maltus has conceived a significant scheme for a new London. 
and I should assist him in realizing it. Why the hell is an Englishman using Lido with a cavalry saber? <laughs> He's filled with Britain! For the Queen! Oh, like the King! Wait, we still had a Queen at this time. We got a Rupee. And some Ether. I'm sure that'll heal our wounds. I think that's used. Can't believe I went through all my turkeys already. I'm gonna have to steal more turkey from the poor citizens of this town. Oh, right, I can use Lamplighter. What does he do? I wasn't able to read before. Wow! Wow! Um, anime up in here! We're anime up in here! What is a man? A missy! A, a, a miser! What is a man? A miserable little pile of gold! <laughs> it's not by my hand I was once again given taxes! They were paid to me by peasants! Wish to pay me taxes! Also, drops not auto-collecting is rough. Yeah, especially when they don't trigger right away. What's this guy's crime? Being ahead? And this dude. Looks like a carpenter. Stop throwing wood at me. You steal men's wages and make them your slaves! Perhaps the same could be said of all corporations. Well, actually, that, that's, that's true. That, that, um, uh, Richter didn't have a retort for that one. He was just like, yeah, you got a point. I'll help you, Dracula. But we made it to London Observatory at long last. Ah, uh, what, what, what is... what's with the fish hook? Your words are as empty as your soul. Mankind ill needs a CEO such as you. And then that thing I said about what is a man. Find Haley Hall. Why is... Also... Oh no, he's dead! Okay, uh-oh. Um, wow, that's... That's far back. But enough talk! Get to work! I, if they're gonna be if they're gonna be Cynthia at a night with this game, they might as well just go whole hog. Have a reference in there. Let's go ahead. I do like the anime lamp lighter. Maybe there's like an upgrade, kind of like this pocket that I got that attracts gold, that will attract like other items to me as well. Even though the coin kind of gets like stuck in midair if I keep on running. All right, this part. I need Night Ghost. Night Ghost does. Night Ghost does the damage. Not enough damage. I think I deserve at least one new weapon drop. That I don't have to, like, pay ghost money to get. I sure hope this game isn't very farmy. Because I think that would be kind of terrible. That's just it. You shouldn't have to do an extra input for every item on the ground. Let's let the player walk over them. What if the player doesn't want more coal in their pocket? Have you ever thought about other people? That's what this game is all about. You have to think about other people's needs besides yourselves. That's because you want to possess everything. I, I don't like these Opera Man sperm. I don't like these Opera Man sperm. That's upsetting. Hmm. 
Also, what is making that noise? I thought it was the Opera Man sperm. I did, I did some kind of weird input where uh, I could like execute a bunch of attacks really. Like, if I'm moving forward, I could attack faster. What is that? What? I was mean to people in life, so I turned into a lizard. I don't have the healing items for this. Let's try other exits. I fought a boss. I don't think I'm going to be going through this whole demo like I did Lies of P. But we could check out a few other routes. Maybe pick up another, like, half dozen side quests while doing so. That's why they handed you all those extra healing items. And, and apparently let you buy a trinket that drops more healing items. Well, there's some cake! I'm gonna have to go down and around. Huh. It's the flea men. I like the flea men! They're just little goblin fellas that are bouncing around. Tried to pause the game in midair. There we go. Take a look at him. Just like a long nosed British person, which is usually most. Never mind. 500 coins you needed for the dress. Oh, I, I, I got the coins. Also, apparently a hook shot is in our future. I need a bomb for that. Now I have to walk all the way back to Pig. I have to walk all the way back to Pig. Because there is no fast travel. There is Pig. Oh, God. Oh, okay. That's something you don't want your players saying when they need to backtrack is, oh, God. That's... that's not... I'm gonna get the dress. I'm gonna do a good deed for Ebenezer. I'm gonna get the dress. Screw her clock. I don't think sh I don't think she should have been. Uh, I don't think she should have paid for the crime of being uh, dedicated to her work. I, th I think that's I think that's wrong. I think the spirits are a bit biased towards extroverts. Because uh, that could that watch could make people happy, and she made it because she's really good at it. It's not- that's not fair. Just because she dedicated her life to be good at making a thing that makes people happy, that's the same thing. That's the same thing as making someone happy. I disagree, spirit! Plus side, if you don't save after you pick up the dress, Falcon Lady... You might be able to death warp back to the map at a save point you use, but I don't think your progress saves. Just your coin progress. Not sure if it auto saves. I didn't see an auto save thing. I think Pig is down from here. This is the train station. Ha! I outrun coin! It's a metaphor! Ah, pig is sleeping. Okay, I want to buy the dress. I don't really want to buy the dress. I could buy Aldair's cloth. And critically strike ghost. But I need to buy this. And I'll take a turkey. Thank you. Okay, 
Okay, I want to see the quest. Delivered the dress to the girl. What did she say the girl was again? She's to the left, I think? She might be in the same screen as a falconer lady. I can always ask her, maybe she'll be given she can give me some hints. Because I think she's off in this direction. Hey, where's that girl at again? Isn't Mansa Musa splendid, but I asked about the girl. Oh, that's great. East side of London. Question is, which side? Top or bottom? That's the observatory. London is a very wacky place. Might be that 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 road right there, the green that I didn't go to. Maybe the one lady by the cemetery who said she was busy. Oh yeah, she is a ghost, which means the girl might have gotten older. Did we see anybody that was like lamenting about their dress? Like, that doesn't make any sense because she said she was standing out in front of a a, a store looking at dresses. I haven't been this way, I don't think. Ghost? I am Casimir. You're looking to increase your capacity for health? I would like to, yes. That's a new item. Ah, oh, so this is what you do with the upgrades. I got enough rosemary for a health upgrade. I need two rosemary now. Great. Those have only been rare drops off of enemies right now. Megorium is here. It says yeehaw. Now, Gunman's Proof was over about an hour ago. We're, we're Scrooging now. Save... Um, I want to say it's up on the top part. Maybe one of the green doors are past the save. Hey, at least that gave me a full heal when I upgraded my health. Ebenezer is more limber than I thought he'd be. Yeah, the, the, the Christmas spirit uplifts you in many ways. It makes your soul as light as a feather. And apparently your body, too. And it, it gives you anime powers. To, to endure grenade. And do this. So look forward to when you, you become ghost. This guy does Pilates. <laughs> what was that uh, RLM thing that they watched? Silver Foxes? He does old man aerobics. I'm hoping... I'm making... I'm taking a gamble. I'm taking a gamble on it being up around here somewhere. If not, I really hope it's not on the main street of London down there. Because that would make me quite upset. It's giving Abraham Lincoln vampire. Yeah, there's a lot of strange things in this game, Megorium. You'd have to watch the VOD later. You would have to watch the VOD later. I saw the I saw the 
the, the camera pan and I was like, what, am I gonna walk into like a Soulsborne boss fight? World's Fair, the Great ex Exhibition. That doesn't look like a clothing store with a girl at it. Otherwise, he won't be able to traverse London beyond the gates of his own mansion. He'd get attacked by ghosts constantly. But at least he has plenty of turkey. That he could just eat on a whim. Back here, I'm not done with you yet. I'm not done with all of you yet! Fire anime! Have you seen a girl? I should have asked that before he killed you again. Did you see the life of P? The lies of P demo is available. Yes. Yes. This. That's why we're doing this. Is because someone mentioned this during the lies of P demo. Oh hey, this is the girl. That's the girl over there. Give it the dress. Excuse me, young lady. I have come across upon this dress, but I have no one who would have your any use for it. Would you like it? Oh my, this dress is beautiful. I always wanted a dress like this. It's the most beautiful dress I have ever seen. I'll be happy to take it. Thank you very much. You did play it and I missed it? Yeah, it was last week. I did it last week. That was positively wonderful. Let's go find more dresses to give. I'm sure I could find them. I'd love to help, but I have very important matters I need to take care of tonight. Oh, fine, let me lend a hand. The quicker you can get me more dresses, I can give away. Yeah, you want help too, right, Musa? Yes, you do. You're ready to go hunting. Select attack ghost in the quick ghost selection wheel on the bottom right. Oh, and she's another attack ghost. I gotta go back and watch it later. Yeah, it, that was that was quite of a trip too. There was donkeys and clowns. I notice you've been quite busy. Again, we still don't know what to do with this ghost stuff, but there's a circus and uh, lots and lots of side quests. There are so many side quests in this game, and there's um. Horses that I was about to say they're, they're not moving, but that they're definitely moving. The horses are definitely moving, confirmed. There's Christmas. There's ghosts. The lamplighter does this. And pecks the heck out of a snowman. So if you're kind of into that thing, uh, keep an eye on it. I don't know when this game comes out. I don't think it has a release date yet. It better be around Christmas time, though, because uh, that would be ve definitely very fitting. If not this year, maybe some year. But uh, I think I think you need to tighten up the graphics a little bit on level three, if you know what I mean. Stuff I've been complaining about, like most of this game, it's just that the, the London is a little too big. London is a little too big. I'm getting- I was getting very bored until the boss fight, and then I was bored again after the boss fight. And I don't think it's supposed to go like that. It doesn't feel like it should go like that. So this is Castlevania Aria of Sorrow. Yeah, the, the ghosts are kind of like your, um, monster souls, I guess. Except you do quests to get them instead of farming. Or maybe they're like your familiars from uh, Symphony of the Night. I so like KH too, too much enjoy space. Empty space. Yeah, there's lots of empty space. You could like, you could trim out several of these rooms. And uh, condense those NPCs a little bit more. 
and maybe like a quest tracking system so uh, I don't have to make gambles on finding out where the lady is. But if, if there's like improvements, I could play this like on one Christmas. I wouldn't mind that. It's a pretty well made uh, Metroidvania otherwise. It just uh, it needs more tightening, that's all. That's that's my expert opinion. My 3,000 subscriber... My almost 3,000 subscriber expert opinion. Just tighten up those graphics on level 3. Oh, uh, for people that arrive very late, there, there's stuff that happened with Mario. You might want to check the Nintendo Directs. The ghost. I mean, they see. I almost forgot. No, no, I can't let you forget. I can't let you forget. It's so cute. It's pretty cute. Trust me, don't. Let me tell you right now. Do not. Do not search Peach Elephant Power Up on Google. I cannot guarantee you will not take psychic damage. Not all of it is looking like this. That's my last warning. Good night, everybody.